Health alerts related to the hot weather have uh, come into effect across England today, with temperatures in some areas forecast to reach 35 Celsius from Thursday. In central and southern England, an amber level 3 alert has been issued until Sunday, one step down from the heatwave last month when temperatures in parts exceeded 40 degrees Celsius for the first time. Now, Thames Water has become the latest water firm to announce plans for a hosepipe ban in the coming weeks. And the cause of all this? Well, the hot air over Britain is being drawn up from southern Europe. And in France, there are warnings that the country is facing its worst drought on record. Our correspondent Mark Lowen reports now from the Loire. The Loire Valley is called the Garden of France, but this garden is wilting. Melting under a fourth heat wave, France is gripped by its worst drought ever recorded. Vincent Favreau's crops, which feed a hundred families, are stunted, his potato yield down by a half amidst a fortnight of hosepipe bans and weeks with no rain. Either the vegetables will die of thirst or they won't develop enough in this crucial period of growth. The sun is evaporating what little water we have left. I've never seen something like this in my 22 years here. If it doesn't rain within two months, it'll be a disaster. Amidst a global food crisis from the war in Ukraine, another breadbasket, France, is showing worrying signs. Et du coup, le maïs, il a pas fécondé. Its corn production is forecast to drop by 18% with the drought, wheat and animal feed also falling. Our planet is not weathering the storm. The Ukraine war has shown how countries must become more independent with their food production. With the conflict and now climate change bringing farming to its knees, there are big questions about how we'll feed our world. Today, the bridge almost feels like a throwback to another era when abundance and high tides meant no picnicking this low down. I shouldn't actually be able to be standing here. This is the middle of the Loire River, but you can see how barren it's become. Locals say that the water has never been so low at this time of the year. A rich and vital resource for this region is depleting. It's a worry for residents and holidaymakers, their place in the sun under new water restrictions. Even though we enjoy the garden, it's a shame not to be able to look after the plants. Um, we're not having any baths, so we're using the shower all the time. Oh. So you just use water a bit sparingly, don't you? You know yeah, what I mean? If you don't need, yeah, you don't use it. Yeah, concerned about the environment. Yeah. And, you know, it's the future, isn't it? It's sort of, you know, the children, the grandchildren. On the fields of France, the water pipes stand idle helpless as our climate warms and our earth bakes. Mark Lowen, BBC News in the Loire Valley.